Here's a human stomach that has been preserved in a distended state. So a completely full stomach after Thanksgiving meal might be this large. Now that depends on the body size of the person, but what I wanna talk about are the sphincters involved with the stomach. So here's the esophagus. There's a sphincter right here that allows food to enter the stomach. And then at the exit of the stomach, there is this sphincter called the pyloric sphincter, which allows the digested or the liquefied food in the stomach to pass into the small intestines.